This is Tom Evans with Kristen Bauer behind the camera bringing you this week's Chronicle Telegram Matt Report, sponsored by Cobos Insurance. Cobos Insurance is locally owned and proud sponsors of Lorain County Wrestling. Please consider Cobos Insurance for all your insurance needs. Two events took place this last weekend that featured wrestling in Lorain County. The LC8, known as the Lorain County Conference, had their lead meet take place at Black River High School on Saturday, with Farlands coming in as the favorite, having gone 7-0 and in dual meets. If you follow the LC8 since its formation, Keystone doesn't take kindly to finishing second in any sport in the three years that the league's been around. Coach Von Driscoll's Wildcats showed up with a little bit of a chip on their shoulder on Saturday and came away with tournament champs amassing 150 points over runner-up Farlands with 137.5 points. And remember last week I told you not to sleep on the host Pirates from Black River as they finished third with 127 points. Keystone sealed the championship with 10 wrestlers earning a place. Champs for the Wildcats were 126-pounder Devin Myers, 138-pound Tristan Green came home with his second title, and 150-pound Diego Morales. Runner-up Firelands came away with two champs, an 106-pounder Colin Ekman and 120-pounder Ruben Pino Lorenzana earning his uh, multiple championships as well. Third place Black River spent their ter- time on the podium finishing with five champs, 113-pound Joe Dennis, 157-pound Brandon Rowland, Charlie Wells at 175 pounds brought home his third championship, and 215-pound Cooper McKeon, along with 285-pound Travis Owen. Rounding out the titles in the Lorain County Conference were from Wellington, Jeremiah McKee as a returning champ at 132 pounds, and Derek Anvil second at 165 pounds brought home his second championship. Other winners were at 144 pounds from Columbia, Dom Governor, and from Brookside at 190 pounds, Carson Nail also brought home a second championship for the Cardinals. The girls took center stage on Sunday at the second ever girls district wrestling tournament held at Lutheran West High School. The tournament is sponsored by the State Wrestling Coaches Association and has recently become a sanctioned sport by the OHSAA, and the OHSAA will sponsor their tournament next year. Lorraine County was well represented as Elyria's junior Riley Banyas brought home her second district title. This will be Riley's third state title appearance as the first year all qualifiers went directly to state. Riley was dominant at 110 pounds and enters the state meet as the second-ranked wrestler in her weight class in the state and currently ranks 17th nationally. Columbia entered three girls with Sarah Napier at 110 and Avion Myers at 235, earning spots in the state meet. And Avon Lake's first year with girls competing had two of their four participants qualify for the state meet, Rajan Al Hashash at 135 pounds and Hattie Hobart at 170 pounds qualified for the state meet. Keystone rounded out Lorain County's participants with two entries, but no qualifiers. This week's state tournament for the girls takes place at Hilliard-Davidson this Saturday and Sunday with wrestling beginning at 11 o'clock on both days. With the high school boys sectionals two weeks away, this week will feature the SWC Southwest Conference Conference meet at North Ridgeville. The JVs will wrestle on Friday night with the varsity tournament taking center stage on Saturday with O'Leary coming in as the favorites undefeated in dual meets and Avon Lake at second. For Kristen Bauer, I'm Tom Evans reminding you to call Cobos Insurance for all your insurance needs. See you next week on the Chronicle Telegram Matt Report.